Everion, please pay attention. Here is a moral play called The Summoning of Every Man. You will see how at the end of our lives, we are transitory. You think that sun is okay in the beginning, but when you're under the earth you begin to cry. Here you shall see how fellowship and kinshi, strength, beauty, and possession will fade away from you like a flower in May. Let us hear what the heavenly king has to say to Evermore. I see how it is now. People no longer see me as their god, but instead their worldly treasures. They no longer fear me, nor remember the laws that I created for them, and that my son's blood spilled between them. For them to have life, I have suffered, and now I see that they forsake me, using the seven deadly sins instead. The more patient I am with every man, the worse it becomes. They are unkind to each other. I must do something about it. Death, where are you? I am here for you, almighty gold. Go to Everman and tell him that he has to go on a journey that he cannot escape from. Make sure he brings a reckoning as soon as possible. Okay? I will look all over the world for him. I will hurt anyone who loves riches and send them to hell for eternity. Oh, look. There's Everman walking over there. Look at him focusing on his treasures. He does not expect my coming. I shall make him regret it. Hey, where are you going so happily? Have you forgotten your maker? Why do you want to know? Who are you? I have been sent from God. Really? What does he want from me? A reckoning? Oh dang. Do I have to go? Look, you must take this journey. You must answer before God. You have done a lot of bad deeds. Who are you? I am not ready for such a journey. I am death. You have to obey me. Look, you've come to me when I least expect you. I'll give you a thousand bucks for you to come back in a few years. Sorry, many people have tried to bribe me, but it doesn't work. Please give me another chance. Twelve years and my books will be balanced. I'll be good from now on. Everyone must die. Don't cry. Prove to your friends that you can do it. Please, God, spare me. Can I not at least have company? If anyone is brave enough to, you may ask them to accompany you. I don't have anyone to join me. I wish I'd never been born. I'm afraid of pain. Maybe Fellowship will join me on this sudden chance. We were good friends on this world. I'll talk to him. Hey, bro. What's up? Why do you look so sad? Well, let me know what's going on so I can help you. Yeah, I'm in a lot of trouble. You can count on me, bro. Tell me everything. You really are a good friend. You've never hurt me before. And I will forever. I'll follow you to hell if I need to. Please, tell me what is on your mind. Well, I've been commanded to go on a dangerous journey. I have to go and talk before God. Please, come with me like you promised you would. Uh, well, I did promise, man, but this is something completely different. I would be in pain if I were to go. I'm too afraid. Sorry. What? I thought you would never forsake me. Yeah, I may have said that, man, but this is something completely different. When would we come back anyway? Never. Exactly. So, I ain't going. I'm sorry. Who's making you go? Uh, death? Well, then I wouldn't for sure. I won't go for anyone, not even my own pa. <laughs> even if you gave me food, gold, and clothing, I would never go. Uh, Alright, goodbye, friend. My heart hurts and I will not see you again. Peace out. Oh, how I am saddened. The journey would have been so much better with a friend. Maybe I'll ask my family. Here we are. We'll always be here for you. Oh, thank goodness. I was told that I have to go on a painful journey that I'll never return from. Oh dear, that sounds very unfortunate. You are so young too. But, sorry, you must go alone. Uh, cousin, will you go with me? No, my toe hurts too bad. Really? When I need you most, do you abandon me? After all I've done for you. Sorry, we can't go with you. Good luck, cuz. Gosh dang it, is this how it comes to be? My family abandons me, just like my friends. I've always loved riches, maybe they'll help me. Where are you, goods? Who calls me? I'm everywhere one can look. I'll help you. It's a different kind of trouble. I'm to go and give an account before the highest judge of all the joy I've had with you. Please, go with me. Money can make everything better. Actually, no. I don't go with anyone on these kind of voyages. Even if I did, it would only be worse for you. 
Your reliance and love for me has made you blind. You're right. I have loved you. And for that you will suffer, if only your love had been a bit less, and you shared me with the poor. Farewell. Have a good day. Curse you. You tricked me. I loved you so, and yet you abandoned me just like kinship and fellowship. I went to you as you meant the most to me. It's my own fault. I hate myself. I guess I can go now to my good deeds, but she's so weak. She cannot go with me, nor even speak, but there's no harm in asking. Good deeds! Where are you? I am practically dead. You have so many sins I can't move. Oh, please help me. I'm so afraid. Look, I know you have to talk to God, but I can hardly move thanks to you. If you had been a better person, I could help you more. Please, give me some advice then. My sister knowledge will go with you instead. Every man, I will be your guide. I leave you in the hands of our savior. Take this water and be cleansed of your sins. Oh, look, I am now strong again. I can go with every man now. My heart is light. I feel so pure. I hear you now, good deeds. Do not weep. God has seen your confession. Now, come meet strength and beauty. How do I meet them? Just call them. My friends, come here. Strength and beauty. Hey, what do you want? With every man on his journey and help him, will you? Yeah, we'll bring him. No biggie. I'll stand near you if you get into any trouble. I'll stay with you till death if you need. Hey, every man you should go to priesthood. He will bless you and give you the holy sacrament. There is no one more important than him, as he can cure all of man's sin. Okay, I'll go get Holy Communion. That is the best thing you can do, as you will receive salvations and hear the Holy Scripture. Jesus hung on the cross for us, so if you have a good priest, you will be clean. Jesus help me. I received the sacrament, so let us now be on our way. All right, let's go. Oof, I'm getting kind of tired. I can hardly stand. Let me rest in this cave for a little bit. Go. No. This is a grave. I can't be smothered out here. Bye. Haha, uh -huh. yeah, sorry, mate, but I've got to go too. Wow. Whoever trusts their strengths finds it leaves them in the end. Both strength and beauty have left, though. They promise to stay. Everything fails me but God. Don't worry, every man. I will always stay with you. You will find me a good friend in times of need. Thank you, good deeds. I see now who my true friends are. Knowledge, are you going to leave me as well? Yes, sorry, every man. I will have to leave you when you die. Well, I think I'm about to die. I'd better go pay my last debts and make my reckoning. Everyone, learn from me that everyone and everything I loved best left me, except for my good deeds. Do not worry. I will speak for you. God have mercy. Into your hands I give my soul. Defend it so that I may be with the angels on doomsday. Now that he has suffered, I think that I hear angels singing. Come, beloved one of Jesus, your soul is clean, but now lives in heaven. You that are listening, let go of your pride, beauty and strength abandoned every moment in the end. Only his good dead remained. Beware. If your good deeds are small, they will do you no help before God after all. You cannot change your past after death. Even mercy and pity will forsake you if your reckoning is not clear when you arrive. If you account this wall, you shall live happily in heaven. Oh, 